he going? Oh, uh, I can't tell. I don't see any directional at all. Anyway, we're on our way out. We went to the market, walked around. We didn't really walk the whole thing. There wasn't really much for, that she should have seen. I saw a couple other people with jewelry that maybe you would have want, want to looked at, but I, my also impression was that it was stuff that you've seen as we've been here during the week. So, wow, look at that car. Um, <clears throat> I spent $11. Uh, Marie spent $0. There was one piece of jewelry that she considered for $75. Uh, but when she checked online, the person we know, we know them well, they said they sell it, uh, it sells online Everybody for 400 Everybody down here is telling me, oh, on eBay it sells for this. I'm yeah, yeah, eBay. Well, that. that's, that's their, their... Then I go and check eBay, and first of all, I can't find what they're saying it's for. <coughs> it, that's... Secondly, yeah. everything I see, they're pricing it at 225 not 400 Yeah, that's the you know? go-to for everybody But then the now. ones that are selling... Yeah. Are selling from sixty to eighty bucks. Right, that's the go-to for everybody now. Which is amazing to me because that was a chunk of silver. No, I know it's a big ass chunk of silver. It was very heavy, uh, but that's the go-to for everybody now. Everybody goes like this. Oh, on eBay, I can put it on eBay. I looked at some stupid uh, turtle figures, and the lady's like, "Oh, those are expensive." I'm like, "Really?" I said, uh, "Well, how much?" She's like, "25." So I looked through them, and then she starts telling me how they put them on eBay, man, 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 right? And I'm like. Okay, so I said, I said, look at them anyway, right? There was maybe eight or ten figures, right? So for twenty-five, I guess two fifty a piece, right? Uh, problem is, I sell these for three dollars, and a lot of them were missing arms and and they were no big deal. So I was like, okay, I pass, you know. Um, she was also all excited about one of the things I bought. Now, again, I spent eleven dollars, but I, I managed to find a five-dollar bill just walking around. Isn't that nice, right? Um, so anyway, I'll just show what I got uh, for my eleven dollars. And I'll start with the uh, CDs. Um, there was a bunch of CDs that one person had. They were selling for like a buck a, uh, a piece. And I went through them, and it was mostly a lot of nonsense. And there were some better titles, but I passed on them because of condition. Here's what I got. I got uh, Ozzy Osbourne Osmosis. There. The lights were backlit, I guess. Um, what's that? That's Kiss Unplugged. Motley Crue Live. That case is screwed up. And I got a Rolling Stone, steel, Rolling Stone Steel Wheels. Okay, and let's see. Actually, I should have another CD, or I overpaid for a dollar because I only see four here. Let's, oh, no, here it is. Scorpions. Face the heat. All right, so five CDs. Um, I got something for free. You got this thing. This is kind of a... Like a, a, a duck decoy thing. It's not a fantastic one. The lady gave it to me for free. Uh, because the head popped off. But a lot of times they make the head separately and then they glue them on. And I was like, you know what? I probably wouldn't have bought it for anything. But when she said free, generally you just take stuff for free. Uh, if I put the head back on, maybe 10 or so dollars at the flea market. So that was free. Um, CDs. Where's that dog? Th oh, here it is. <coughs> the lady I spent the dollar with who gave me the, the duck uh, decoy type sculpture for free, I bought this. And this is just a cool mid-century modern funky dog uh, pottery, kind of art pottery sculpture, kind of like that. Uh, what do you call this kind of dog with the long floppy ears? Somebody said it looked like a cartoon type character. I was like, I don't know. I doubt it. It's just funky 70s, 60s pottery sculpture. Nothing too special about it. But probably the most valuable thing I got today, I paid five bucks for. And again, there was a lot of stuff at the flea market, a lot of stuff to see. And if you look hard, I'm sure you can find stuff, but prices are not cheap. I think you, if you go early, maybe you get lucky. That's why you see all those guys there early with the flashlights. You gotta eat this, you gotta eat that, you gotta eat it, you know hoping to get stuff. I think if you go later in the day and you shop hard and look hard and you negotiate and you really talk to the people, maybe get some deals, you know. Uh, but I just was looking for surface stuff. Again, uh, unless it's amazing, I don't care, you know what I mean? Uh, but here, this is probably the nicest piece of glass that I did get. Look at that bag. It's falling off. Um, I don't know if it's Fenton, but it has kind of a, a lacy pattern. It has a ruffle top. It's opalescent. Um, Kind of a milk, milky open lesson, but in clear. I'll find out what it is when I get home, but automatically I'm assuming it's worth about 40 bucks. 
possibly a little bit more uh, once I attribute it uh, to what I get. Uh, that's it. I mean, we're going to go probably to one more flea market tomorrow. We probably won't go early. We'll go to that Thursday one maybe uh, just to cruise through. Um, any impressions on the market today? I know you were saying like, oh, maybe we should have done it. No, I spoke to people and they said there's a lot of well, walkers, but nobody's Yeah, done. going in, you were like, maybe we should have done it. Coming out, you're no, like, eh, who cares? parking lot was very it's full. Too hot. I died there it is very hot like today. And this nothing. is winter. You know, I think it was like 80s or, you know, but it, the sun is strong. It's supposed to be 85 today. Is it? Yeah. And it's a solid, strong sun. Uh, but all right, that's it. Um, maybe I'll find something tomorrow. I doubt it, you know. And then I'll be back to Jersey where I do my normal shopping. Anyway, here, bye. All right, you want me to call Daisy? Oh, I forgot. This is the $5. Everything's backlit. This is the five dollar bill I found. So that means everything that cost me eleven dollars only cost me five dollars. Playing right there in the center. Yeah. What did I just say? Uh, everything I spent five eleven only cost me eleven. Only cost me five. <laughs> five. No, well, no, I I saved five because I found this. I only spent six on everything that I showed you today, which is even a better deal. <laughs> Yay! Thumbs up for finding money. Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. And this is the last time we're going to Northside. We're not going very early. It's about 9 o'clock? Uh, 8.54, yeah. Yeah. Which means, like, any super awesome deal should be gone. But we might find a few things. You know, we're not really shopping hardcore. Um, you know, and I'm not buying nonsense to bring back. But this is our last chance. We already got our honey, so we don't have to buy honey from the guy. I want to get avocados. Oh, yeah, we're going to eat some of those Hopefully, big, giant avocados. I was avocados. worried because there was a lot more people at the flea market yesterday, and I was worried those northerners would buy up all her avocados before I got them. Yeah. Well, I mean, some people just buy them from the stores. They don't like going like, ew, that grew from a tree? No, you know, that's people don't better get that. if it's off somebody's tree. Well, you think that way, but a lot of people are like, ugh, that grew off a tree in somebody's yard. You know, it doesn't even so have any fresher. pesticides on it. Well, a lot of people don't think that way. They don't, you know, they're like, no, it's got to come off a, f a farm. It's got to be GMO'd. <laughs> that is better. What is this in the road? Uh, I don't know. Uh, guess what's in the road? Piece of tree. Oh, it's a piece of tree. Piece of For a second, I thought it was like an armadillo or something. No. All right, so anyway, uh, we're going to Northside, Wednesday market. We're not going to sell. We're just going to shop. Maybe we'll find some good stuff. We shall see. Well, the first thing I'm going to say is that this market is way more crowded with potential customers than it was last week for sure. Normally we park on that side over there. Um, but today, and we're not here that late. It's like 9 o'clock. Today, we're parked all the way on the other side, which is whatever. And the parking goes all the way down there. We actually got a pretty decent spot. Um, I don't know if there'll be more vendors. There should be, I guess. I don't know if the quality of the stuff the brenders are bringing out will be better. I don't even know if I'll find anything. We're mostly doing this for the sport of it. Uh, but we shall see. Um, and maybe I'll try and do a little bit of undercover hunting. You know, I can't make the videos too long down here. And I said it before because my mom's internet is not the best. Uh, but we'll see. If I see anything really interesting, I'll film it.